Hi. Today we're uh, we're going to do a little section out on the range about um, what people who carry concealed really should consider, and uh, we're going to do it with his brand new Springfield XDM in nine millimeter. Um, pretty nice gun. Just picked it up. We're going to run the first rounds through it out on our range. Uh, we just uh, picked it up uh, today, actually. Um, so we've got, we've got one of these in 40 caliber. Now, now we have one in 9, and we'll see how it does. But uh, this is really a nice gun. Adjustable rear sides, fiber optic front side, 5 and a quarter inch uh, barrel. It's got the lightning cut on the top to take some weight out of it. Uh, nice reset on the trigger. XDM. So we're going to give it a try. But one of the things we want to talk about today is uh, if you are if you carry concealed you really should challenge yourself to shoot uh, some challenging drills that put you in a situation where you have to draw from concealment, where you have to score hits uh, for accuracy and you have to do it against the time clock. One of the things we're going to do today is we've taken um, a federal air marshal qualification. It's a 30 round qualification and uh, 5 points per round, 150 points possible. You have to score 135 or better to pass. That means you can have 3 hits that are um, off the, the standard uh, qualification target. But we're going to shoot that today. Uh, just demonstrate uh, some things that a concealed carry permit holder can do to put themselves uh, in a situation where, they, uh, where they're going to have to be uh, drawing their gun and firing it. So good good training. If you carry concealed, put yourself up against some of these drills and, uh, and hopefully uh, you'll like it. Thanks. We're heading out to the range right now. We're going to shoot it from concealed, so we'll open up the shirt. Okay, there's the first part. Okay, there's the speed reloads. Now we'll fire one on each of two targets. We'll shoot the two outside targets from the low ready. that one in from the from the holster but that's basically the idea
Okay. This next drill, we're going to be turned this way, uprange. I'm going to turn 180 degrees like this. And when I turn, I'm going to draw from conceal. I'm going to turn. I'm going to shoot one shot on each of those targets. And then we'll repeat that so you can see it twice. Okay. So I'm facing this way. Okay, not too good. I threw one off. Let's try that again. And again, I'm doing this cold turkey, literally. I have not practiced this. All right, let's try that one more time. Obviously, I need to practice. Let's give that another go. Okay, we're going to fire one shot. I've set it up. So I'll go empty. We're going to start from the low ready. We're going to fire a shot. It's going to go empty. I'm going to drop to one knee, and then I'm going to speed reload um, out of my, my reloads here. We'll do that twice. All right, here we go. Let's try that again. Obviously much too slow. I'm not going to be a federal air marshal at this rate. All right, a little bit better. I think that's the whole course. Um, obviously, you have to shoot a pretty high percentage to be an air marshal, and I missed some. We'll take the camera down and take a look how I did. Okay, here we are looking at the targets. Let's start with this middle one. First of all, let me say that if I were a federal air marshal, uh, I would not have passed. You have to have 135 points to pass this. short on uh, being able to qualify. So I missed it. Missed it. Anyway, I thought this was kind of an interesting thing and I highly suggest testing yourself against this uh, if you're carrying concealed. And uh, it's a lot of fun even if you're not a concealed carry permit holder. It's still a lot of fun to do. So anyway, thanks for watching. Hope this has been helpful. Okay, we finished the uh, air marshal qualification here. Um, it's a little bit uh, cool out today. It's finally become winter here, but uh, I've got about eight rounds left, and uh, so before I head back to the house and uh, finish working on my chores, um, I'm going to shoot for some accuracy. I'll shoot on that center target, shoot for that little round uh, circle up in the corner there. We're out.
out just beyond 10 yards with a brand new uh, Springfield XDM 5.25. And again, this is a sweet gun. Um, I actually got it in a drawing at our gun club. Um, I did get lucky. But, uh, so uh, we're breaking it in, basically. And uh, it's a, a very nice gun. We've already done a video on this same gun in 40 caliber. But since I had a 40, I decided to, you know, I'll take a 9, two 40s. But a uh, very sweet gun. Fiber octave is very nice. Want to shoot better? Fiber optic on the front. Anyway, here we go. Shoot at that center target. I guess I better put my hearing protection on. So let me do that before we go any further, and I get more depth than I already am. All righty then. Here we go. We are clear. Let's go down and take a look, see how we did. Well, okay, here we are down at the target, and there you can see I was shooting at that circle right there. <coughs> oh, excuse me there. Uh, put, I don't know, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, maybe rounds in there. But I was aiming right there at the center, and um, had some good hits. I uh, went a little high, it looks like, but uh, left and right, east and west, uh, however you prefer, they look like they were fine. Uh, the gun is brand new. These are the first 30 or 40 or 50 rounds ever been put through it, so it'll definitely break in a little bit. But it, um, and that was just beyond 10 yards, uh, 30 feet or so. Uh, so, you know, after it breaks in a little, then I'll adjust the sights on it. It does have adjustable sights. That's a sweet thing about these uh, 525s. And, of course, you get a get another look at these targets and there's the ones I I missed there's three there that would have been some passengers or flight crew that wouldn't have been happy with me uh, Warhawk Defense Air Marshals would not be uh, very welcome on that airliner again uh, had a couple of misses on that one as well as you can see and this one I didn't have any misses on but, uh, you know, all those little splatters and things you see on there was from another video we did. We recycled targets. Uh, we're cheap. But, um, anyway, sweet gun. Shoots great. Um, I'm never going to be an air marshal, uh, so you'll never have to worry about seeing me on an airplane. Um, that's it. Um, thanks for watching. See you later.